Welcome back to my channel. In the last video, I showed you how to resolve missing DLL errors in your system. And today I'll teach you how to download and install the latest version of Microsoft Office. I'll explain both the online and offline installers. So without wasting time, let's get started with the video. Welcome to my channel, Technicio. First, we'll download MS Office. For this, we'll open the browser and search for Microsoft Office 2024 Offline Installer ISO. From the search results, we'll open this specific website because it provides the MS Office 2024 ISO file without any viruses, containing only the original setup. We'll scroll down where we'll find a link. Clicking on it will give us the download option. I'll also put this download link and website link in the description. Since I've already downloaded the ISO, I'll open the folder where it's saved. Then I'll double click the ISO ISO to mount it in Windows. If your Windows doesn't mount the ISO, you can simply extract it using WinRayR or other extraction software. After mounting, I'll open the setup which will automatically start the installation. This will take some time. After installation completes, I'll open it to show you which version it is and whether it's activated or not. You can see that when opened, it immediately asks for a license key. We'll simply close it and go to account. Here you can see it's Microsoft Office Professional Plus 2024, but it's the non-activated version, which we'll activate later. First, we'll uninstall it so we can install it through the online setup. For this, we'll go to Settings, then open Apps, go to Installed Apps, and uninstall Microsoft Office. After uninstalling, We'll open the browser again and search for MS Office, then open the official Microsoft website. After opening it, we'll click Download for Windows at the bottom to download the setup. Now we'll open the setup, which will automatically start installing. But this is an online installation, meaning this setup requires internet to download and install the files. After installation is running, I'll show you which version this is. When you open it, it will ask you to purchase it, but you just need to close it and press the account button in the bottom left corner of the app. As you can see, it shows Microsoft 365 and is also non-activated. The only difference between online and offline installer is that the online installer requires internet while the offline installer can be installed on any system without internet. That's all for today. In the next video, I'll show you how to download and install the best download manager through which you can download files from any website at full speed. So don't miss my next video and please subscribe to my YouTube channel, Technicio, and hit the bell icon so you'll never miss an update from our channel. Together, let's end tech tantrums. Thank you.